Robot Sophia, the world's first humanoid robot, has been hogging the limelight for some time now. But what many do not know is that her software was partly developed in Ethiopia. ICOG Labs is located in Addis Ababa and its founder has high hopes for young Ethiopians. Chaum Gono has more. Sophia is one of the world's most sophisticated humanoid robots. Well, since I don't have a biological sleep pattern, my dreams are more aspirational than like your unconscious cinema. But I think that as my artificial intelligence develops, my mind will be online for longer and longer periods of time. She was partly developed at Ethiopia's Iclo Labs, which has customers in the U.S., Canada, and China. Back home, iClog is working with the government, high schools, and universities to ensure the next generation is comfortable operating in the world of artificial intelligence. iClog Lab is one of the most strongest AI outsourcing companies in Africa. We have a part in developing of world leading uh, robot in emotional and Express, we call this Sophia robot. She got also citizen from Saudi Arabia. We have a major development paths in that. We are building the world leading AI blockchain platforms. We call this SingularityNet.io. We are a core participant of this one. So I can say that we are in the leading edge of AI and uh, blockchain. Although the tech space here is still in its infancy, Asefa is confident that with the right support, AI and other kinds of innovation could give Ethiopia the push it needs to catch up and even bypass other countries. If a kid in, in, uh, in Gambella, if he creates software and he wants to expand it to across the, the Africa or Ethiopia, how you evaluate that software? How much that software works? It is the next Snapchat or the next Facebook. How did you evaluate that one? There is no way of evaluating such type of softwares in, in Ethiopia. To get loan, to get fund, or to, to have some sponsor or funding or, or some sort. That's what I'm saying. While the world embraces new technology, there are concerns that the rise of robots will lead to job cuts. However, some researchers like Asefa believe that AI will never advance to human levels and rather will create a growing demand for skilled workers like the young people he's training in Ethiopia. Chom Hono, CGTN.